Until you feel like the fast, yeah, yeah. Fast, fast, fast. Ah! What? Fast, fast, fast. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean to tell you <laughs> Baby, listen Shout out to my subscriber Who knows how to give me up <laughs> and, 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 and get me to Doing some research. You know what I mean? She know I'm going to find it. <laughs> huh? They already know. If they say the right thing, Auntie Fee going to get that ass up. Be like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Now what? Let me read this again. Now what? Me and Jay did what? <laughs> yes, indeed, Auntie. Yes, indeed. See, sometimes you got to put them, you know, Auntie Fia put them, them people in your life. <laughs> uh-huh. Call, call everybody. Put everybody. Uh-huh. Tell them they asses ain't doing their job. Tell them they stalling. They playing with everybody else. And they not solving my man's case. Hello. So what now? Me, baby. Me and Jay went to the stone. She went to the pit. She went to who? <laughs> she went to where? Hello. Uh huh. She went to the stone. Rolling stone. Facts, facts. Huh? 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 What? Yeah. They are mishandling of the young Dolph case. To, oh, and she did it on his on on Dolph Day. That's when it came out. Baby, I say around the mouse. All of them. So them reporters and People will start calling their asses and asking for their side of the story. Forget that local stuff. I, <laughs> Auntie Fee, are you... T I, I am tickled. Yes. That's not acceptable. That's not acceptable. Yeah. You think it's a joke? You think you think I'm a joke? Oh, uh, Okay. Well, I want to laugh, too. How about that? Huh? I want something to giggle at, too. I want to make Auntie Fee giggle. <laughs> and guess what? I'm giggling. Because as soon as I went out there, I was like, whoa, Jack. Okay. Yeah. Auntie Fee is proud of you. Mia J. Ah! I'm proud of you. Yes, indeed. Sometimes we got to let folk know. Yeah, because look at here, young lady. I had somebody who had a whole song and dance. <laughs> In my com comment section that I have not approved. Because your name is blocked, baby girl, with until I get approval. Until I approve it. Can't nobody see it. High five, ain't TV. Can you high five me? I got you, doll. Uh-huh. So, I'm sitting up here reading it. Contemplating on, should I let it through just, <laughs> just to block them? You know? But I had to do a little research. You know what I mean? Because he was saying that, you know, mad because I gave you little praise in the last video and showed Dolph singing the song about he 
you know, you got into his head enough that he gonna keep you around. Uh huh. You you prancing around in that. You know, you know how you do when you modeling. <laughs> so I guess it rubbed him the wrong way. Uh huh. So uh, he was saying, "How could I? Well, not me. How could you let them cookie people?" Auntie Phil, are you stuck? Yeah, I'm looking. Uh huh. Yeah, because I'm trying to see if I need. Yeah, uh uh. I'm gonna stay right here. We're gonna stay right here. How how you let them cookie people make money off them cookies? So I was going to let it through. Uh huh. And show and, and put in there. They said they gave the cookies away. They was giving the dog cookies away. So, that's why I said shout out to Makita's because ain't that what the news people say? Ain't that what she was saying through them YouTube streets that she they was doing a service? A service is giving it away, right? So, surely, surely they gave them away. So, I was contemplating, do I just go on and block them? <laughs> you know, because they don't... I didn't respond to the first comment, so they bring their ass back and put another song and dance. Okay? Mm -hmm. So, it's still back there. It's uh, Shout out to you for making me get up and go find the article. So, just in case somebody think I'm lying. Shout out to you. Mwah, mwah. But it was this one here. This one him that I'm talking about. And I didn't respond, you know. And then, then I see this one. Same people. Okay, so let me get on back here because this is what it says. Rolling Stones. Exclusive. She bitten her frustration. So, so after I read that, I go and read another comp comment from a reliable, respectful, you know, regular, tea simple who kind of implied that maybe they did not hand out them cookies. Like, did they charge for, for the Dolph Day cookies Day of service. Yeah. So it's a way. As I was pondering that is when I saw the message that you, ma'am, are circulating. <laughs> huh? You circulating. And I ain't mad at you. So like I said, don't come to my page telling me shit about me or Jay. Okay? Nothing. You have been warned. This lady is making effort to make sure her man, our homie, <laughs> our king of Memphis, the man who did it best, the man of honor, gangster integrity, because he was gangster, we ain't trying to act like he wasn't. gets his justice and they indict everybody who conspired to have him killed and if you don't like that she's sassy and classy cause she ain't done nothing to no, none of y'all oh uh, last week was first time that she kind of raised her voice that y'all and cussed y'all asses out okay okay 
And if it wasn't for her, half the shit they have done probably wouldn't have been done. So back up again and leave her be. And let her handle her business. Okay? So, and about them cookies, I don't know if she charged them folk, but that ain't how she, they repped it. That ain't how they kind of put it out there. They said that they was doing it for a day of service and was saying, well, what everybody else going to do? What y'all going to do for the community? So they made it seem like while, while a pre was handed out turkeys, they mom and daddy and sister, everybody was going to be handing out them cookies. Now, I'm assuming that you came in and bought some regular cookies and they had, I, I thought they said they had a thousand. That's what the news people and made it seem like they was giving out a thousand cookies. But surely y'all wouldn't put the price on them on the day of service. Truly. Please don't tell me that. Where is Morris? Where is the guy who was counting the cookies in the back? That's walk down gang. Where he at? Because, see, you know, don't play them type of games like that. So, I don't know if they charged. I don't, I, you know. But when uh, the other person made mention of it where they really wasn't, they really wasn't giving them out. She, somebody need to clarify that. But let me get to the news article. Dang. Y'all show was a cute couple. Hmm. You know, it's funny. No, I'm going to leave that alone. I'm going to leave it alone. Two years worth of unknowing. Two years worth of of people not properly communicating with you, she told the publication. Mm -hmm. Attention would hurt or help. Mm, feel like they weren't being taken seriously. Yeah, because see, I had noticed that Carlisa kept on th channel 13 she she kind of went in in depth i was going to touch basis on that about you know advocating and uh you know getting them to communicate better with them and oh the da had a news article that came behind it to illustrate that they had reached out to the da's office uh-huh so, I kn I knew that she had talked, her and Carlisa had talked, or, you know, however that went. But, baby, when I, yeah, put it out there. She want to know why, because there's no just justifiable reason for her. To end his life. I know that's right. You impact my family. You impact. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah. Are you proud of yourself for that? Knowing straight drive? Yeah. He proud. No statement. Remember? He proud. Bravo. See, I have it right here. Friends have been commemorating his life with the second annual Dolph Day of Service. Hello, I'm Greg Hurst. Hi, I'm Stephanie Skirlock. I have it right here. Jones joins us now live after speaking with the rapper. I have the uh, <laughs> thumbnail. I already, yeah, because, <laughs> baby, I didn't know that you would. Steph, young Dolph's sister told me that since his killing, <laughs> the family go. has been experiencing a roller coaster of emotions. They say to overshadow the sadness. They say today they did something that young Dolph loved to do, and that's give back. 
Long live Dolph. I want to say that before, just in case, you know, my thing cut off. Long live Dolph. Young Dolph's sister told me that since his killing, the family has been experiencing a roller coaster of emotions. They say to overshadow the sadness. They say today they did something that Young Dolph loved to do, and that's give back. I will become a great man because my heart is like my dad. The 36 year old rapper whose real name Cause is his heart is like his dad. Junior, left behind two young children who two years later celebrate a father who left an unforgettable mark on many. Happy holiday, okay? So today, on the anniversary of his death, the Ida Mae Foundation, named after young Dolph's grandmother, honored his legacy with the second annual Dolph Day of Service. His sister, Carlos Brown, says this is how Dolph should be remembered. He just changed so many lives. How he had a heart of gold and gave back to so many people. Following in his footsteps, hundreds of free turkeys, meals, and haircuts were given out. There was also a special surprise for students at Lamont on College. His sister, sporting a black man, deserves to grow old sweatshirt to the festivities. A movement started by Dolph's partner, Mia J. It's more of an empowering thing, you know, educating our people to do better and want to do better. So let me be clear. Dolph's family <laughs> loves and honor her. So whatever decisions y'all think that she's making, they are making as well. It's not that she's just making that. She communicates very well and together with Dolph's family. So back up off of that Mia J letting them, Mia J did, did, did. It's a family. They not beefing. They not f fighting over in the state. They not doing none of that bull crap. They are wanting justice together. Okay, are we clear? We clear? Shout out to Jay Fizzle. Shout out to Fizzle. A black man deserves to go get your sweatshirt. To the festivities, a movement started by Dolph's partner Mia J. It's more of an empowering thing, you know, educating our people to do better and want to do better, um, and not taking someone's life, you know, for senseless things. It has been two years since rap star Young Dolph Slang rocked the city of Memphis. Is that what I'm saying? Like, why y'all go take him with me? The revelation he was no longer living, hitting many as his camouflage Corvette was towed away from Makita's cookies as hundreds watched in disbelief along Airways Boulevard. And now, two years later, his family I want to is switch still shirt. advocating for justice, urging people to put pressure on agencies looking into Dolph's murder. That would be a piece of our healing journey, you know. I think everyone is going through something like this, but want that urging people to put pressure on agencies looking into Dolph's murder. That would be a piece of our healing journey, you know. I think everyone is going through something like this, but want that piece of closure to know that um, whoever did harm to this person, that they reap what they sow. In a statement, Deputy District Attorney Paul Hagerman says in part, we have been and remain on course for justice. Now, as now she putting heat up under you. You, you, you were so calm, cool, and collected. You was, you know. Now, I know that was on, not the, I, now I know it's the feds, and they trying to get up that conspiracy for a RICO. I get that. But Mia J has lit a fire. And she finna smoke y'all asses out. Now y'all gonna piss or get off the pot. We want justice for doll. And we don't want no more fluff. We want justice.
So even though the judge in the court has changed, y'all still in position to go on as the same time. It's not going to stall y'all. So we have been and remain on course for justice. You need to keep her informed. No, no funny business. Cause she going to tell the people. Auntie Phil, you stir. Yes, I'm staring at him. I, 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 yes, I am. Y'all got too much. They, well, they. Let, let me get to Shelby County, cause that ain't you ain't Shelby County. They got a whole bunch of trifling boor crap sneakery. I told y'all it was an inside mob. I told y'all sneaking phone. Fake people, how how fake people get in there, huh? How that happen? All of them, all of me. Where's the National Guard? Now there's an article that says that they was deployed to in Memphis in 2020 to keep the peace. It's time to do it again. Lieutenant Colonel Chris Messina says after several mayors requested it over the weekend. Tennessee Governor Bill Lee activated the Tennessee Guard in several cities where protesters were descending. Currently, we have uh, or well over. Uh, they need to do this again. Uh, well trained Tennessee National uh, that have been mobilized across uh, all three divisions of the state to assist uh, state and local governments, law enforcement, and first responders. He says for security reasons, he can't say how many.